Hi guys, it's Lynn here. Hope everyone is having a blooming wonderful day. Now today, I'm in the polytunnel again and it is early morning and we have got two of our Echinopsis subdenu data cacti that are both blooming beautiful at the same time. And uh, here I am, here are the two very beautiful Echinopsis subdeniodatus, commonly known as the domino cactus because of its lovely little spotty woolly um, furry fuzzy little areoles and uh, here is the other one here and these are actually, these are actually my fiance Hansi's cact um, Echinopsis subdeniodatus that he had when he lived in Sweden and he brought them over over with him when he moved over to live with me in Ireland over four years ago now and this one is one that uh, Hans has had for a very long time. It's very multi-headed, as you can see there. And beautiful, beautiful, beautiful plant. And that's the lovely, the lovely, completely sort of white bloom there. Absolutely gorgeous. And the scent in the polytunnel today, I'm not, I'm not kidding you guys. It smells, it's hard to say the exact smell, but imagine a bit of jasmine with a bit of hyacinth and a bit of vanilla all mixed together. That's the only way to describe it. I keep getting a scent of a bit vanilla-y, a bit chocolatey, um, hyacinth-y, and then a bit of jasmine as well. And even a bit, a bit, a bit of a lang lang or, or as well. It's just the most gorgeous fragrance. Beautiful. And uh, lots more buds as well on the way there. So wonderful to see and uh, lots of lovely buds as well on our other echinopsises. Now this little echinopsis of Jenny Data here as well also in beautiful bloom. The bloom is different and although it's completely white there I'll just show you it has green outer petals much sort of a sort of a greeny yellow goldeny outer petals so it's a different type of bloom a much smaller bloom as well although it's very large bloom in comparison to the tiny little size of it as you can see there and what is special about this particular one is that this is actually from a seed from Hans's own plant the big Echinopsis subgenidata this one here that's in bud at the moment is the mother plant of um, this little baby here and this is actually seed grown from Hans that he sowed the seed when he lived in Sweden when this uh, the mother plant here flowered and he got the seed from it and this is actually a, a baby a um, bit bigger than a seedling obviously now that actually has grown from the seed from this mother plant so very uh, very extra special so I'm sure that the big mother here is looking on proudly at um, it's little baby here in beautiful little flower and another bud on the way as well. So absolutely gorgeous to see, as you can see there. Very nice. And then this other subde Echinopsis subdenudata that's bloomy beautiful. That's So you just come out as you can see it a bit better with the bloom. But it's interesting because the blooms are different, even though it's the same plant. But isn't that beautiful? Oh. The only sad thing about Echinopsis blooms, as I'm sure those of you will be aware that have these plants, they really don't last long. They last, they open up sort of during the night time and then they're gone usually by the middle of the day. So very happy to capture this while I can. So I made sure I got up early as I could before they start to go down again. Absolutely beautiful. I was gonna say the two different varieties with the bloom is very different. So guys, thank you so much for watching. And if you want to know how to get your cacti and succulents to flower, then do check out the video I've made on how to get your cacti and succulents to flower. Links up above and down below in the video description. And also you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook at Desert Plants of Avalon. And also for, for regular blogs and tips and tricks on how to care for cacti and succulents. And also check my website out, desertplantsofavalon.com. I want to send you loads of love. Heaps of happiness and tons and tons of flower power from across the Emerald Isle. And until my next video, bye.